Have you ever lost anything in space? Over. It isn't every day you get to talk to an astronaut. We misplace stuff all the time in space. It's very frustrating. Much less an astronaut currently in space. What happens in an emergency like a fire on the space station? Over. That's exactly what a group of students from Moreland Heights were doing thanks to a program called ARIS, or Amateur Radio on the Space Station. I know a lot of schools get to do that, and um, it's like a li one, once in a lifetime experience. Volunteers from the Radio Amateur Club of Knoxville coordinated with NASA to set up a signal to the orbiting International Space Station, where a selected group of students were able to talk live with astronaut Ricky Arnold. I feel good that we had no failures, no equipment failures. That was big because we uh, put a lot of time in to make sure everything worked. Moreland Heights becoming one of just 25 schools across the country to take part in a unique program. Hopefully they'll uh, be inspired to uh, do more uh, STEM type academics and uh, who knows where they might be. I would love for some of my kids to be astronauts or engineers or anything STEM related that they are interested in. We'd like to thank you. Thank you.